So uh, thanks a lot, uh, you know, Vikram, for having me here and a very good evening. I think that it's very clear when we look at the relative data that we are already a beacon uh, for a number of reasons. I think one of the biggest reasons that was highlighted uh, today actually at the World Bank press release, uh, in addition to this growth data, was around poverty management uh, that's come out, you know, from the bank. While we can, of course, agree or disagree on the level of multidimensional poverty that is prevailing in the country at this moment, that is, that is a separate discussion. But at the same time, we must understand that India has done very well globally in terms of preventing slides into poverty during COVID. You know, so we have seen an increase in income inequality. We have definitely seen, uh, you know, uh, issues with how, uh, you know, the kind of social protection we could have given, much more could have been given. But at the same time, it has, you know, been acknowledged that the public distribution system, the PM Garib Kalyan, Anna Yojana, and some of the other cash transfer and fuel transfer schemes that were brought into place in the social protection architecture, the way it was expanded at a you know, very fast pace and delivered uh, you know, in an efficient manner have been lauded by the World Bank today as well, in addition to our growth figures. Now, when it comes to the state of the economy as a whole, definitely we can see a little bit of a divide emerging in the economy in the post-COVID period. We know that we are experiencing a K-shaped recovery to some extent, and there are certain sectors that are doing much better than others. I think it's a time for re-evaluation, reassessment to see which sectors can really serve us well in a future which is more climate resilient in a more sustainable way in the next you know, 10 or 20 years but also look at the sectors that we need to invest in for the next five years yes. to really capture that momentum. Yes. An example being electric vehicles. Right. You know, that, that is a sector where India can really stand out in 